their accommodation. Our findings have led to debates about whether psychosis is in itself neurotoxic and whether potentially damaging changes to the brain are related to the length of psychotic episodes. Project Titan allows us to strengthen the individual's ability to cope with such changes. Early results were promising, but it was only after the arrival of Patient X that our expectations were raised. Patient X was the catalyst that led to a full-scale adoption of the Titan process. We must all know. Performing just below my predicted expectations. At this rate, you'll never beat me. Interview 39. Patient's name is Edward Nigma. At this point in time, I have yet to decide if Mr. Nigma is a suitable candidate for the Titan process. I'd like to talk about your childhood. Miserable. Next. By all accounts, that is where your fascination with riddles began. I believe discussing those years could explain your compulsive behavior. Very well. My father hated me. Always called me a moron. I was determined to prove him wrong, so I entered a contest at school. A $20 prize to the kid who could figure out an almost impossible logic problem. I won, of course. And that pleased your father? Hardly. He was convinced I had cheated. He kept yelling, you must have cheated! Admit it, you moron! You cheated! But I swore I didn't. And he hit me for lying. I'm sorry to hear that, Edward. Don't be. He was right. speak. You're safe now. But, but it's a trap! I know. Just not for me. <gasps> it's true! You really are the world's greatest detective! How did you do that, Bats? Oh, what the hell? Get down there, boys! See if he can detect being punched in the face! Oh, 
waiting for it. Don't lose me! Don't get too full of yourself, Bats. I'm just softening you up. Think of this as a preview to the main event. You'll see. I'm sorry. I tried to tell you. I couldn't speak. Relax, you're safe now. I can handle these low-life thugs. Will all patients please remain calm and move slowly to their accommodation? I'm not sure I can keep it a secret any longer. I've got two old friends coming to the party. One of them is just terrified to leave us alone. The other, well, let's just say he's going to be surprised to see you, and you will be to see him. Who's the guy? When that means some of the bitches can't. We represent all medical specialties and offer a wide range of medical, surgical, diagnostic, and wellness programs. High quality of care coupled with Arkham Asylum's convenient location have ensured we are voted the number one facility in the entire state. Times have changed at this establishment. It's the best! <laughs>
I can't let that man die. All three bands agree. We got full power. Rose the enemy attack. I shouldn't have left intensive treatment. I would have made sure that freak stayed where he belonged. Patient interview 44. This is yet another interview with Edward Nigma. I have yet to make up my mind whether he's a genius or just deluded. Whichever one he is, just being in his company is both irritating and exhausting. Hello, Miss Young. You look tired. Anything you need my help with? No, thank you, Edward. I am here to help you. We all are. Forgive my arrogance, Doctor, but if you think I need your help, well, you're in the right place. Let's look at it a different way. Throughout your career, you have specialized in bizarre... I've got three minutes. It's a bit of a... Them. Are they okay? Yes, they're safe now. Batman, we've got another problem. I need to get back to the mansion. All my research notes are there. We can't risk Joker getting his hands on them. It's not safe, Doctor. The island's a war zone. You won't stand a chance. It's my life's work. You really don't have the authority to... I'll get her there, Batman. You ask me, it's about time for a little payback. I don't like it, but... Who called the elevator? It wasn't us. It's coming from the lower floor. Cash, take Dr. Young. Get her notes and then find somewhere safe to hold up. Everyone else, go to the observation room. Barricade yourselves in. The boss says he's in here somewhere. Spread out. I hate... metal box hanging precariously over a deadly drop what say i just blow the emergency brake center off you like a sack of puppies say good night bats boom <laughs> only kidding 
got a few more surprises in store for you. Prepare to face your fears. All of them! <laughs> I'm sorry, Jim. Barbara, I... I'm sorry. I was too late. I'm sorry. The number you've dialed isn't available. Please leave a message after the tone. Barbara, are you there? Please hang up your phone.
tear your mind apart. with Scarecrow slowed me down. I'll get back to you in a bit. I'd have solved all the puzzles by now. It wasn't Gordon. Crane's gas must have affected me more than I thought. Are you lost, little bat? Having trouble figuring out what's real and what's just a figment of your twisted little mind? Say here. <laughs> just roll with it, bats. It gets easier once you're gay. It really does. could have been solved by a monkey. But good job, nevertheless. Joke is not messy. He wants the old man kept safe from Batman. Anyone gets near him, and it won't be me carrying the can. No problem. Nothing's getting past me. Batman will be a dead man, and I'll be safe. Whatever. Get over there and keep looking. Now go! Remember, you even smell an man in tights, and Harley kills the old man.
population is just dying for one of you to spot the bat freak. When you do, Harley offs the old man. I've got a shiny prize for the one who sees him first. Detective has solved the <laughs> You took longer than I thought. He's out of control. He's trying to prove something. I'm not sure I can stop him this time. You'll do it. Batman, listen. We're not alone. He's got something else down there. I don't know what it is. What a blab about! Spoiling the surprise. Be quiet. Oh, am I getting to you? Am I? <laughs> You're going to love this next bit. It wants Dr. Young's login. Never mind that. Get behind me. Now. Bane. I thought he broke out of Blackgate. Cut. Did this to you, Doctor Young, the Bruja. She drained the venom from my blood. Must stop her. Sorry, Hasbane. The good doctor won't be a problem much longer. How do you like my puppet? What say we cut him down? <laughs>
have gotten loose while Bane was throwing you around. We need to get you off the island. I'm not a rookie. I can handle myself. I will break you, Batman! Then the Bruja! No, Bane. This time I break you! Jim, get back to the mainland. It's too dangerous here. I don't like leaving you here. Radio claims he's planted bombs all over Gotham. Gotham will panic. You're needed there. We're ready to go now, sir. Bane called Dr. Young Bruja. What does it mean? It's Spanish for witch. Oracle, go through the city's computers. Pull up all you can find on Dr. Young. I'll go through anything you find once I get to the cave. A bat cave on Arkham Island? I built it years ago. It's best to plan ahead for situations like this. How'd you manage to keep this a secret? It's me, remember? So do you think Dr. Young's been experimenting with venom? The same chemical that turns Bane into that animal? Yes, I'm worried. Bane seemed even more powerful than usual. Joker wants the venom, and that can only be trouble. I'm heading to Dead Man's Point in Arkham North. I'll contact you once I'm in the Batcave. My family's blood ran through the heart of Gotham. We were doctors, politicians, and teachers. We have been the organ cleaning the arterial filth from the city. We have been its servants, giving all to protect it. And still it has chosen to hurt us. saved an unfortunate inmate from leaping off into the rocks below. I found a cave entrance and over the years have moved a number of supplies here. It's a regular home away from home.
As Gotham's veins slowly filled with pain and suffering, the effects were felt everywhere. My father fell first, infected by some foul disease. My mother lived on, but only in a dream. I returned to the family home to care for her, where she remained in her bed for as long as her body continued to breathe. Her tears kept me awake at night. She was experimenting on the Arkham patients. This new chemical only barely resembles the original venom compound. There are a number of changes that appear to amplify the strength of the drug. Multiple references to a Titan formula. Even a small amount could trigger a venom-like transformation in the host, eliminating the need for the storage tank Bane requires. Hang on. These notes aren't complete. The formula is missing. That must be the secret Dr. Young is hiding. If Joker gets his hands on this, he will create an army of a thousand Banes. My god. Is Joker crazy enough to do that? What am I saying? You've got to stop him. after her. She was heading to the mansion with cash. I'm going up top via the catacombs. Find them than you figured it would. Oh, I'm sorry. I'll try and be more precise next time I'm planning an island takeover. Yeah? Calling all cars. Calling all cars. <laughs> Why are we the ones trying to open? He's here!
One of Joker's oldest aliases. So, Joker pays Dr. Young to create his army, and then all of a sudden he stops. Doesn't make any sense. That was one of the easy ones. Sounds like she had a change of heart. She tried to block the payments. Joker doesn't like it when his partners try to back out. So he decided to get himself back to Arkham, find his formula, and create the army himself. Exactly. I've hacked into her email accounts. Two mails stand out. The first is a resignation letter dated last week. Sounds like she was trying to get away. And the second? A message from Joker. Well, Jack White. It's a long thread. Uh, she's begging to stop the experiment, says it's too dangerous. She's not listening, let's see. Random threats to her family, a couple of bad jokes, a picture of a dead baby in the threat. Go on. He says, I'm coming for you, I want what I paid for. And then, another joke about wheelchair, lovely. And the drawing of some kind of donkey. No mystery why she's so scared. I'm coming up to the surface, I'll find her. A challenge completed. Can you do more? that gave it away. The big green glowing question mark. Can you hear that, detective? It's the sound of me clapping at your success. Oh, you can't? That's because an idiot would have found that trophy.
patient named Waylon Jones, a.k.a. Killer Croc. So, is this the part where you try and reason with me? Find out why I did it, Doc! We're here to help you, Mr. Jones. You got a cure for me then, Doc? Can you make me normal? Normal is a poor choice of words. No one's really normal, are they? <clears throat> Figured as much. So, how about this, Doc? You let me go now, and I won't eat you. You don't really eat people. It's just an urban myth. Oh, you think? <laughs> Keep up. have access to the armory. My journey lasted little over a month. Visiting academics in both Metropolis and Keystone, I was exposed to a wealth of new ideas. I began my day returning home in good spirits, eager to see my wife and family. I ended it kneeling in their blood, broken fragments of my life. Pouring through dripping red fingers.
men in the guard towers covering your movements. Be careful. Her both loose talons. You see trigger fingers and, well, you know, that's what you have them. Interview 17, Joker remains uncooperative. My earlier diagnosis remains true. I believe he enjoys his persona too much. What Joker here? Now that I'm in charge, I'd like to hear all your feedback on the place. I'm especially proud of the decor, and I hope it helps you all become more productive in our task of taking over. Thank <laughs> you. 